Picture this, your child with ADHD or autism is building a Lego tower and it keeps falling apart. They're frustrated and they ask you for help. You know meltdown is coming, so you step in and you fix it for them. They calm down and resume playing. Problem solved, right? But here's the thing. When you jump in too quickly, your kid learns that when things get tough, all they need to do is for you to swoop in and save the day. What they don't get to learn is how to stay calm, keep trying and figure things out on their own. Over time, this can make them feel like they can't handle challenges on their own. It's a direct path for your child to feel disempowered and nobody wants that. So what's a better way to help them out while at the same time build their confidence and problem solving skills? Consider these four tips. One, acknowledge their frustration. Say something like, I see that you've been working hard on this and it's so frustrating when it keeps falling. Two, help them stay calm. We all solve problems better when we're calm. Try saying, let's figure this out together so that they know they're not alone. Three, work together. If they're stuck, give them just enough help to keep them going. Point out what might be the issue, like, it looks like the bottom blocks are not strong enough. How about if we try using bigger ones? Can you help me find some bigger blocks? I like to preface the possible solutions with, I don't know if it will work, but let's try it. If it doesn't work, we'll try something else. This encourages your child to keep an open mind and embrace a trial and error process as opposed to feeling pressured to find the perfect solution. Four, cheer on the effort. Celebrate that they've kept on trying no matter what the outcome was. With this approach, they learn to handle frustration, build problem-solving skills, and believe in themselves. They'll feel more confident facing challenges knowing that they can't figure things out with a bit of patience and effort. So how do you relate to this?